Good morning, everyone. It is the full first full day of fall, and I'm really, really excited. Um, put up a little decor, and then it got really hot and muggy here where I am, and we put the air conditioner on. So, needless to say, I'm a little aggravated, but before we get into all of today's updates, don't forget to like this video by giving me a big fat thumbs up. Show me some loving. Come on, folks. I need thumbs up. I need views. I need more subscribers. So don't forget to hit the bell icon and subscribe to my channel. It's free, and you get to hear from me every day. Okay, so back to what is going on on my little homestead. I am still gardening. I started canning. Um, I did a few products on so water bathing. I did um, some peaches and some blueberry jam. And I really enjoyed it. I only did like half pint jars because I wasn't sure if I was going to like, you know, blow up the, the jar or something. I didn't know what was going to happen. So I really enjoyed it. And now I'm thinking like I have some vegetables out there that I want to can. Um, and it'll save a lot of room in the freezer. So I'm going to be doing that. I've also done some dehydrating. Um, none of the things that I dried except for the chili peppers were my own. Um, there were some frozen vegetables and some canned vegetables. Again, I wanted to make room in the pantry and in the freezer, so I dehydrated them. Other than that, I went out and I purchased myself something yesterday. Guess what I got? Yep, a pressure canner. I've been stocking up on some jars and lids and canning supplies. And um, I'm just trying to be a little prepared for the winter. You don't know what's going to come up. But there is something that's going on, and it's really, um, I don't know. I don't understand this. It's like every single item that you want in the stores, there's three different reasons why there's a shortage of it. And now they're saying turkeys for Thanksgiving. Um are going to be in short supply because of the carbon dioxide is in sh short supply or something that they use to gas the animals. I, I mean, I don't know. That's what they say. It just seems like all the holidays are being targeted. I mean, we will find all summer, and the minute fall starts, now there's not going to be turkeys for Thanksgiving, and toys and Christmas gifts are going to be stuck at the ports without being able to be shipped in. That tells me that this is definitely, definitely the handiwork of the enemy. There is no way that this is God making this happen. This is the enemy, and this is what we have maybe allowed to happen through the ages with selfishness and sin and gluttony and, and everything else. And... Things became very secular. And now we're going to see what it's like to not have a turkey on one of the biggest days to give thanks. And what it's going to be like when the kids don't have any toys under the Christmas tree. Or if they really want something, you can't find it because everything is get made, guess where? Yep, China. So you could say whatever you want about President Trump. Whatever you want. Vote the way you want. I don't care. I'm a Trump supporter because he was pro-American. We had stuff being... Companies coming back to the United States to manufacture stuff. We need to get back to that. It's going to be a rough holiday season. There is no two ways about it. But keep your eye on the Lord. Keep your eye on the prize. Do the best you can. And make sure that no matter what... You spend time with the Lord, and you spend time with your family. That's it, folks. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe.